Question number 6. Recently, which city municipal corporation with the support of the Asian Development Bank launched the country's first flood forecasting and early warning system? Option A. Mumbai. Option B. Amaravati. Option C. Chennai. Option D. Kolkata. The right answer is Kolkata. Flood forecasting and early warning system. India's first flood forecasting and early warning system was inaugurated in Kolkata to help people of the city to be better prepared in case of heavy rain and flood. The system has been designed to provide real-time updates from sensor nodes installed in key points throughout the city. According to the sources, Kolkata is among the 10 most vulnerable cities in the world from natural disasters. The system will reduce economic loss and impacts on livelihood and improve flood awareness and safety at the community level. The Asian Development Bank funded the design and implementation of the flood forecasting and early warning system. Recently, which state government announced that the first Khadi Mall of the country will be opened soon? Option A. Chhattisgarh. Option B. Madhya Pradesh. Option C. Odisha. Option D. Jharkhand. The right answer is Jharkhand. Khadi Mall. According to the Honorable Chief Minister of Jharkhand, Raghubar Das, first Kadi Mall of the country to be opened in Jharkhand soon. It will bring changes in people lives and the government will also provide markets to them. Through the initiative of the Kadi board, many people in the rural area have got jobs and the board was also providing them with markets. Question number 8. Recently, G7 Environment Meeting 2018 held in Canada with the theme of Working Together on Climate Change, Oceans and Clean Energy. From the following countries, which is not a G7 member? Option A. Canada. Option B. China. Option C. Italy. Option D. Germany. The right answer is China. China is not a member of G7. Canada, Italy, Germany, all these countries are G7 members. The group of seven, G7. The group of seven is an informal group of seven of the world's advanced economies consisting of Canada, United States, France, United Kingdom, Germany, Italy and Japan. The European Union is a non-enumerated member of the G7, but neither chairs nor hosts summits. See, Canada and United States are North American countries. Okay, from North America, Canada and United States. From Europe, France, United Kingdom, Germany and Italy, four countries. From Asia, Japan, the only country from Asia is Japan in G7. So remember these points. So examiner may ask you these questions also. And also European Union is also important. It is a non-enumerated member. Question number 9. Asia's first blue flag certified beach. Option A. Chandrabhaga. Option B. Kovalam Beach. Option C. Walcom Beach. 
ऑप्शन डी मेरीना बीच द राइट आंसर इज चंद्रभागा बीच The blue flag program was first started in Paris and its main objective was to make all the beaches environment friendly. One in every 6 beaches with blue flag status worldwide are in Spain. Chandrabaga beach of Odisha's Konark coast was the first to complete the tag certification process. According to the senior ministry official 13 beaches from the coastal states has been chosen for the blue flag certification under the project in 2018 the indian beaches are being developed by the society for integrated coastal management sicom sicom is an environment ministry is body working for the management of coastal areas according to the blue flag certification standards Question number ten. Beam is a mobile app developed by National Payments Corporation of India (NPCI) based on the Unified Payments Interface (UPI). Beam stands for Option A, Bharat Interface for Mobile; Option B, Bharat Interface for Money; Option C, Bharat Interaction for Money; Option D, Bharat Interaction for Mobile. The right answer is Bharat Interface for Money. Bharat Interface for Money (Bhim) is a payment app that lets us make simple, easy, and quick transactions using Unified Payments Interface (UPI). One can make direct bank payments to anyone on UPI using their UPI ID or scanning their QR with the Bhim app. One can also request money through the app from a UPI ID to bring in financial inclusion to the nation and a digitally empowered society beam has been conceived and launched by the honorable prime minister of india narendra modi on 30th december 2016 beam was developed by national payments corporation of india npci NPCI National Payments Corporation of India is an umbrella organization for operating retail payments and settlement systems in India it is an initiative of reserve bank of india and indian banks association under the provisions of the payment and settlement system act 2007 for creating a robust payment and settlement infrastructure in india